This channel is a group of investigative journalists who make educational documentaries showcasing and educating society, especially parents and legal guardians, about potential scenarios that result from young people and adults conversating online if left unchecked. We conduct thorough interviews with consenting adults in an attempt to understand their perspective on why they partake in these conversations online with people that are not of age. The goal of the interviews in these videos and the videos themselves is to gain an understanding of the perspective of the individual being interviewed so parents and the rest of society can be educated and aware of potential thought processes and desires of adults online to unsupervised persons not of age. These videos are not to cyberbully, harass, degrade, accuse, or threaten any individuals partaking in the interview process or in the video itself. We do not condone any of these actions. These videos are strictly educational, and we grant full permission for academia, which is any classroom setting or in scholarly papers, to show or cite our videos. To ensure that these videos are strictly used for educational purposes, we strictly adhere to YouTube's community guidelines, such as not revealing someone's personally identifiable information, in other words, PII. YouTube defines personally identifiable information as their home address, email addresses, signing credentials, phone numbers, passport number, medical records, or bank account information. We thoroughly look at and edit our videos to ensure that none of this information about any individual is shown in our videos. To ensure extra privacy for each person that is a subject of an interview in any of our videos, as of September 1st, 2022, to thoroughly comply with YouTube's harassment and bullying policy, there will be no mention or information about the last name or first name of any person interviewed in our videos. Due to potentially illegal activities discussed in our videos, law enforcement in the respective jurisdiction we conduct these interviews in is notified of each interview and video filmed by us. We are not accusing any individual interviewed of being guilty or committing a crime. That is the job of law enforcement. We are not vigilantes and we do not condone vigilantism or vigilante behavior, such as taking the law into your own hand or not notifying law enforcement when a suspected crime takes place. We are investigative journalists. Trigger warning. Some of what can be discussed in these videos can be sensitive to some, emotional, or stressful. The only goal of these videos is to educate the public. At the end of each video, as of September 1st, 2022, there will be an educational portion at the end to discuss what was talked about in the video and to discuss what people can, what people can take from that video and learn from and tell others about. Our goal here is to bring awareness and educate the public. Now the video will start. What's up guys? A lot of you guys may know about the Gordon Flowers hoodie. However, we also have a fried pickles hoodie as you can see right here. And Gordon Flowers sweatshirts that you can get in many, many different colors. Show your support for the Gordon Flowers movement and the PP movement by getting one of these. I can tell you they are very, very comfortable. Like in all seriousness they are. And I actually do wear them. So uh, be sure to get one of these and enjoy the video. What's up guys? Before this video starts, be sure to follow us on all platforms including on Rumble, which you can find in the pinned comment. Um, this platform has been giving a lot of people like us a lot of problems lately, and <clears throat> Rumble is a lot more receptive um, to free speech and whatnot. So be sure to follow us on Rumble. Um, any video on here you can also find on Rumble, and if you're looking for a video and can't find it on here, it'll be on our Rumble. So be sure to follow us on Rumble in the pinned comment. Like the video. <laughs> He's walking there. He's on his way. That's the p that is the p spaghetti. Let's see, all right, it's kind of gonna get kind of park like right there. Just kind of follow him here. I'm just gonna park out of the pizza. Park at the circuit, okay? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Right, you can put the you can put the camera down. Now. <laughs> <laughs> is it spike one? Yeah. Okay. There he is going in. <laughs> there he is going in. All right, when he comes out with the whiskey, that's when we'll pop him. All right. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yep, here you go. All right. Not yet. Let him, let him pass the car. And you know how to zoom in, right, Brandon? Just to kind of like go in with the screen. What's he getting? What does he have in his bag? Check it. What you doing in there? You put like little bottles. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that whiskey? Yeah, he's drinking. Oh, that's whiskey. Oh yeah. Let's go. Get behind me, y'all. You got the keys for? Her? I got the keys. Oh, you're good. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Ski 
Excuse me. Hey, Bailey, I gotta talk to you about what's going on here with Emily, okay? She got the cameras going for safety reasons, all right, but I have everything here. Um, I'm not here to tell everybody here about this. I think we should probably have a talk over there, okay? Okay. All right, sounds good. It's all voluntary, of course, but my name is Gordon. Nice to meet you. Sorry to meet you under the circumstance, but, uh, you know, I don't want to. It's a stupid mistake, that's it. I don't know. Yeah, and dude, I know you're only uh, 22 years old, so, yeah. you know, I'm not, you know, I, I get that, okay? Yeah. Right, so let's, uh, let's kind of go, by I'm not here to hurt you, of course, but let's go behind there, if it's okay. Mind removing your sunglasses for me? Gracias. If you don't mind keeping them off, just gotta make sure there's nothing in your eyes, yeah. Okay, let's go with the shade here. I don't want it to get too too hot. Okay. So I mean, you know, obviously before we get into really anything, I mean, what do you what do you do for work? I uh, am unemployed right now. Okay, you don't do the painting thing. I I'm thinking about switching that, but yeah. right now I'm unemployed. I understand I've made a mistake, and I'll delete everything and all that. Mm -hmm. What's uh, I mean, before that, like, dude, and, and I totally know, dude, I know this is hard to talk about, okay? That's why we're over here, not in the middle of Circle K, all right, yeah. you know? But, um, you know, when I was when I was 22, I made my fair share of shit too. Yeah. So don't, 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 uh, get, don't get me wrong here. I'm not judging you for any of this, okay? What I'm paranoid of right now about is the, uh, just being reported to the cops. I kind of don't want that. Well, all I wanted is to talk to you, okay? okay. So, uh, I mean, I'm willing to talk. I mean, help me help you. Yeah. Yeah. So, before we, I mean, how, how old's Emily? She told me 11. Okay. And, you know, like I said, man, um, I'm not here to judge you, but I'm also here thinking that you're an honest guy. So, yeah, I'm an honest guy. I made a huge mistake. Yeah. I mean, I, I was kind of just going to walk home. I wasn't even going to show up. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, before we really get into all of this, I mean, when did this stuff kind of start for you? Um, kind of whenever I was 18, but I never really acted on it. Mm -hmm. That's when you mentioned, like, I'm going to use some words here that are pretty, let's just say not the most flattering, but like to have an honest talk. I mean, that's just yeah. what we're here for, okay? Yeah. That's pretty much when the child started for you? Yeah, I just never really acted on it. Right, it was more of just online stuff. Online stuff, Right, yeah. right. So this was supposed to be like the one time you're going to go meet somebody and yeah. whatnot. Yeah, okay. but then I like went to the gym and I was doing some thinking while I was working out a little bit. I was just like, yeah, no, I'm not going to do it. I'm mm -hmm. too paranoid. Yeah, I mean, I'm more cons like more, you know, kind of concerned about yeah. like how this started for you because, you know, if we yeah. can get that on the right path, I, you know. I first found her on Twitter uh -huh. and all that, like a long time ago, like January, but I never really talked to her. Right. Until like maybe two weeks ago. Right, and that's kind of when it kind of escalated? Yeah. Okay, okay. So basically, you know, before we really get into Emily, I mean, you know, there's obviously a lot of steps that happened since you were 18 that kind of yeah. brought you here today, you know. Yeah. And obviously like, you know, I know this is something that you kind of hid from your parents for, for as long as it's been going on, right? Yeah. yeah. So, how did the basically the child start for you? Like, how did you just uh, find out one day, like, okay, I'm going to try this? Yeah, pretty much. I just said I'm going to try it, and I went to the deep web. Oh, dark web. Yeah. Okay. Because that was the only place I knew where to find it. Yeah. Yeah. Did somebody like kind of guide you that way, or did you just say, you know what, I'm just going to try it? Just try it. Okay. And then it kind of just developed into an addiction and i'm trying to get off of it yeah that. probably seen some pretty bad stuff i have yeah yeah um, so you know you mentioned in these messages like you know obviously you weren't born like this you know but the internet kind of pulls good people like you into yeah. bad places and stuff but it got to the point where i mean there seems to be like an attraction to infants now yeah that's mainly why i'm trying to get out of it and all that because i don't want it to like happen or even act on it right right i mean have you seen just because like look i know like you haven't acted on it before and whatnot yeah. but you know obviously there are people that i'm sure you've interacted with that have you know yeah. people that produce these images and type of stuff yeah how many bit. yeah how many times have you been sent like stuff with infants like infant not really much it's mainly like give me give me like a we'll, we'll figure out each one just give me like a ballpark number for the infant stuff 
No infants at all, surprisingly. Well, you said it's not really that much. It, it's like toddler, not infant, toddler. like four okay. minimum. Okay. That's what I've been sent and all that. Yeah. Yeah, and that's basically what you sh spread around to? I, no, I don't spread it, no. Don't spread it? No. Okay. You just kind of receive it? Yeah, I just okay. receive it. Got it. And <clears throat> so you basically find it in dark web? Yeah. Telegram groups? Telegram groups, yeah. Instagram? No Instagram. No Instagram. Facebook? Uh, that's... Uh, well, I first found Emily on Twitter and then found her on Facebook and my friend's suggestion. Okay. Yeah, no, I'm just talking about like right now, like the, just the child and stuff, yeah. because, you know, I kind of want to figure out like what led, what led, what led this path today, you yeah. know, because, you know, I, I didn't wake up at 18, just like, okay, I'm going to go do this, you know, like yeah. it's a progression. So any child on Twitter, it's all been just Telegram yeah. and dark web. Telegram okay. And dark web. All right. When's the last time you were on the dark web? Years ago. Okay. But Telegram was recently. Okay. I'd say couple months ago now. okay yeah I mean you still have it uh, I'm I do but I'm not really on it at okay all. I'm thinking about even deleting it mm -hmm. because you know uh, you mentioned in the messages like a few days ago um, you know like I said it's, it's a man you know we have hormones going but you know kind of in your meat so or do you just kind of your meat to stuff on your gallery already or do you find new stuff or I just watch normal Okay, but you know, you mentioned yeah, I, with I, the with the pocket that yeah. you were, you know, I don't know, I know, I know you watch your that's, first. That's my own imagination, not the internet. Okay, okay. So I mean, currently, so currently on your phone, there's probably shit you should get rid of though, right now, in the thousands, probably, a couple hundred. Then that's what I'm thinking, a couple hundred. Couple hundred. And plus, I'm thinking about getting a new phone and changing my number and just starting new. Yeah, yeah. So are the couple, you mentioned in the messages, the couple hundred images are basically just basically child images and child videos? It's mostly videos. Okay, okay. Taking up a lot of space on your phone? Not really. Just, are they like hour long or a few minutes or? A couple seconds max. Couple seconds max, yeah. okay. And then the rest are just images and whatnot? Yeah. Okay, okay. So. Do you, you mentioned you get these images from people that claim they're underage or from a traders or? Yeah, pretty much. Okay. Is it, well, which one, traders, underage or a combination? Both. Both? Okay. So you, basically the people with like the, like the uh, pizza emoji is their thing? Yeah. Okay. So it, it's fair to say, I mean, from when, it, like I said, dude, like there's a difference between a sickness and an addiction. Okay. Yeah. I, I think it's a genuine addiction. An, an addiction. You're right. But it, it's, it's fair to say that, you know, you probably go around at least sometimes kind of looking for this stuff. I mean, if you're, if you're dealing with the pizza yeah. people, I yeah. mean, okay. So it, it, when, when, when do you think, I mean, you mentioned at 18 when you started like saying, I'm going to try it. But since then, you know, you've just been seeking it out back in here and there or. I don't seek it out much. I just like advertising groups, asking for it. And yeah. Just people send it to me. Okay. Okay. So you just kind of put out an ad, like send this stuff to me. And, yeah. Okay. Okay. And yeah, you said your preference is age is four to fifteen of what you watch and stuff. That's. I'm not here to judge you for that. Sent. Yeah. Yeah. Because, I mean, in, in the messages, it's mentioned that, you know, and like I said, I'm not here to judge you for it. Yeah. I have an attraction to chocolate cake, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, we all have, we're all trying to the things that we're not proud to tell other people about. But, yeah. you know, again, I'm, dude, I'm not here to judge you for it because I know you haven't acted out on it before. Yeah. But, you know, so you mentioned your age is... You want to stand up here? I don't want to feel like I'm sure, taller Sure, sure, sure. You mentioned your age is like 4 to 15 of... Yeah, just because that's just what's been sent to me. Okay, and that's kind of, is that kind of just what you've been the meat to sometimes? Yeah. Okay, okay. So, so the infant stuff, that's more of just, is that kind of, is that kind of that start when you were 18 too, or is that kind of a new thing? Kind of a new thing that kind of got me into thinking, whoa, like. Like I'm going too far? Yeah. Okay, okay. And also I've been kind of feeling nauseated about, like I've been kind of thinking about it, not like, just like thinking like I'm really watching this and feeling nauseous and all that. Right, right. Have you ever wanted to tell anybody about it? No? no. You think you were just kind of going to just put it to the side and just never do it again eventually? Yeah. Okay. 
Yeah, because look, I don't think you need any trouble. I just think you need some help, man. And Yeah, I'm in counseling right now. It's just I'm scared to talk to my counselor about it. Right, right. Well, I mean, I don't know how cliche this sounds, but I mean, I'm here for you, man. That's why I'm talking to you about this yeah. type of stuff. Because, you know, if you were 50 years old, I think you probably deserve a knuckle sandwich, some handcuffs, oh, yeah, you know. Definitely. But like, you know, I get you're like 22 and, you know. Yeah. Shit, shit happens at 22 that doesn't need to be affecting you at 30, you know? Yeah. So that, that's kind of my thing. Um, just what, What's in the bag? Is there whiskey in there? Yeah, there's whiskey in there, okay. but I was just going to drink it all. Yeah. Just Let me just the see. Yukon Jack, honey, that I sent pictures of. Oh, a little... God, this is a little... This looks like a little canister of <laughs> With you, I don't know which one it is. I mean, look <laughs> at the, your messages, but... Um, okay. Is there a... What's there's it, what else another in? one, towel for working out, uh -huh. deodorant, and water. That tissue is yeah. sweat. Right. What were you, uh, what were you uh, hitting in the gym? I was just doing a little bit of cardio. Stretching for some hip thrusts later? <laughs> no, just kidding. Um, Okay. Well, so basically, I mean, obviously, uh, you know, Emily asked you, are there any other miners online besides me that are near you? Yeah. And you said no. So has it just been... Just her. Okay. Just like that's near you? At all. Really. Okay. Well, I mean, you know, Bailey, looking at your following on Twitter and Facebook and whatnot, I mean... I'm you not know, really active. Right, right. But I, I know there's people that claim that they're underage that yeah, send you this type that's, of stuff. Yeah, that's why I'm saying not that I know of. Okay. That they're underage or not. Yeah, I said they could be, but I genuinely don't know. There's just people that looked like minors that sent you no, images? No, they said or? that they were. They said that they were? Yeah. Okay. Did they send you images of themselves, or did they send you... Quote unquote. Okay. Just it just looked like probably another kid. Yeah. Okay. So probably traitors. Probably. Okay. Okay. So, I mean, looking at like the Twitter following, I mean, you know, I, that's not for you, by the way. <laughs> Did you just hear it? Okay. There was like a fire truck earlier. But looking at like the, <clears throat> looking at like the Twitter following and stuff, I mean, there's obviously other younger ladies under 18 besides Emily. I mean, yeah. you know, I know how, I know how the addiction kind of works. I mean, I know. Yeah, but I, I just, if, if whenever I gave the follow all option, that's all I pressed. I wasn't even like looking through them to see if there was anything. I mean, do you just say hello or something? Not even that. Okay, so, I mean, Bailey, I did do a little bit of research on you and your online history. Like, I mean, the ch the child stuff I kind of already knew about, but yeah. you know, I know there was maybe if they didn't say respond back, but I know you're at least just saying hi to everybody that follows you or if you follow. If they look semi real. Okay, so you just kind of, is it not like mass hellos then? Yeah, pretty much. Okay. Is it fair to say it's probably to adults and minors? Whoever follows Just whoever that. follows you? Yeah. Okay. So that, that's not something you're really looking for an age on? You're just no. kind of saying hello to everybody? Yeah. Okay. So the other people that claim they're underage, how old they claim to be? 16, 15, uh -huh. around that area. Anyone that was like Emily's age? No. Any that were like maybe like younger adults, like 13, 14? Okay. So looking at those other ages, like younger, that's all just been through. Yeah. Okay. So, <clears throat> yeah, I mean, the chat started pretty, the chat started pretty uh, cordially here. So is Emily just kind of a cute girl online to you? Pretty much. Okay. <clears throat> and, you know, we, uh, we can cut through, obviously, a lot of these. You know, I'm not trying to put you on blast here, but... <clears throat> You know, we could either, I mean, you know, I, I mean, I think we're going to get to the truth, just having a talk without really having to use these. But yeah. I mean, you know, before, before I may have to show them, I mean, is there, is there a lot of pictures sent from your end? A little bit. <laughs> I don't know exactly the number. Right. But is there probably over five? Probably. Okay. Probably between five and 10? Yeah, it's probably safe. Okay. All right. I mean, this is, I think one, the first one, yeah. one. I mean, we have like a ballpark number, but you know, just basically, let me just, <clears throat> let me just go over. We're good. Let me just kind of go over this here. Basically, yeah. just to get this out of the way, no one, no one hacked your account or nobody yeah, like, no, no okay. It was, okay. It was all me. Okay. I made a stupid mistake. Okay. Okay. I'm working on trying to. I appreciate that. that. For sure, man. For sure. Okay. Yeah. So November 10th, that's kind of when y'all started calling each other.
Yeah, pretty much. Okay. Said I'm also into minors. Yeah. Said how long you been into kids since I was. And you guys can record me blocking and deleting her conversation and blocking her and all that if you want. To. Oh yeah, we'll definitely get to that for sure. I appreciate that. Okay. Yeah, I mean, another another picture. That's your. You sent that picture. Yes. Okay. All the messages are me. Okay. All right. Cool. I'll stop asking that then. <laughs> Okay, so honestly, I have a crush on you. So it was like a kind of a mutual crush. Maybe. Yeah. Okay. Were there I love you's exchange between well, the two of you? I think she liked me more before I liked her, to be honest. Okay. Because I kind of asked her more about it and all that. Yeah. So she, so were you kind of thinking, oh, she's she's okay with this, so I'm just gonna kind of go along, or? Yeah, that's the original intent. Okay. And just kind of seeing where she took it. And then it kind of went to that. Yeah. Yeah. Because here, I mean, I think the first, like, sample thing, I bet your pussy tastes good. Yeah. Okay. I'll have to find out someday. Um, you got an LA Fitness membership. Yeah. Okay. And then here, uh, she asks you, do you want to eat an infant's pussy? And you said, I'd do it. And she said, but I'd rather I eat mean, you, I mean, in my head, whenever she said that, I was like... I know, but you know, there was also yeah. double texting, like about hey, because she mentioned she had as an infant sister, yeah. and you know, there was a double text saying, saying you could lick your sister's, and then a double text you could lick it again. I mean, I think yeah. that was kind of a kind of got carried away there. Yeah. Okay. So I'm sure after the fact you kind of felt gross, but yeah, like I, I kind of did, yeah. Right, but I mean, I think during it, I mean, what was going on? Hormones and shit. Hormones. Do you, do you think maybe you get a rush out of something like, and it's, it's a brash word, dude. Again, I, I, I was thinking that maybe I'm just addicted to like risk of it or something. Right. I was about to ask the taboo, maybe. Yeah, I think that's what it is. Mm -hmm. To be honest. So it's it's more of just you know because you mentioned you know the reason that you don't like infants too much is because they can't do too much, but it's still child. Like yeah. I think it's just said verbatim. Is yeah, that's word for word if that. Yeah. So you think it's you you think it's just more of like a nobody find nobody's finding out about this. It's hot. Yeah, pretty much. Okay. And then like that probably developed into the addiction and all that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, the internet's not a good place. <laughs> no. No, not at all. Okay, so basically, you know, and again, I should have have asked you about it. it's 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 not easy, but I'm just. I'm just again, dude. I'm just gonna be honest because appreciate I that. Get fucked up and appreciate I'm willing that. to get help for let's, it. Let's do it. So, how did the, how did the dog stuff start for you? Mainly, I was really young and I just kind of did the same thing as with the child. Just was like, okay, why not? Yeah. So, the dog did that start for you before the child. Oh gosh. Like the, years and years before. Okay. And then it kind of turned into children and dogs. That was also like sent during the trying to like, it, like during the height of the addiction of the child. Like a dog and have a child having yeah, sex? Yeah, like whenever okay. I entered the telegram. Part oh of gosh. Yeah. They were sending that shit to you? And that, that kind of got you addicted to that too? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, because here he said a fantasy was watching a little girl getting her Licked yeah. by a dog and two girls. Yeah. Okay. Do you have like your hat kind of sideways so you can just be like yo 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 dog and shit? Just how I normally do it. All right, dog. I got your dog. <laughs> okay. So I wouldn't mind if you were my dirty little secret girlfriend. So I assume this was trying to be kept a secret. Yeah. Okay. What what if she said I don't want to be your girlfriend? With it. Okay, so it's kind of up to her. Yeah. Okay. I'm not into forcing shit. Oh, I I appreciate that. Okay. Do you want to be my dirty secret little girlfriend? So you guys did video chat once, right? Yeah. Okay. We did. Were you on there? I was. Okay. And you showed her your. Yes. Okay. Let me teach you tonight. Okay. So the the dog stuff. I mean, you know. And dog I, stuff was repressed for years and years and years and years, and then like came back up like recently. Mm -hmm. So basically, with the with the dogs, I mean, you know, and like I said, dude, it's 
This is for safety reasons. It's, it's yeah. between us. But what, what's going on with your dogs at home, man? They're males and they're fine. They're not doing anything. Okay. Did they? They're not doing nothing. I'm not even looking last. Okay. Well, it was mentioned that they do. Yeah. Okay. But How many they, times did that happen? That was probably whenever I was 13. Okay. So how many times do you think they licked your butt? Once at max. Once at max. Yeah. Okay. Because, you know, in the coal, I mean, it was mentioned again, dude, I'm not here to judge you, but look, I can, I can see your online history. I can't, yeah. I don't have, you know, I don't have video cameras yeah. in your house. So, I yeah. mean, you're just gonna have to film me in here. I mean, truly, yeah. I mean, I don't think you're gonna do that with your dogs again, no. but you know, when's the last time it happened? Okay. How is it? Anything recently? No. Okay. They lick the shit out of your ass? Uh, not the shit, because I usually wipe. Okay. So the douche douched? Huh? The, uh, the, okay, you wiped it, you cleaned it? Yeah. Okay. Then he sent a few <laughs> videos? Yeah. Okay. And here it said it would be really hot to see a dog lick your just kind of fantasizing about that going on? Yeah, pretty much. Okay. So when you sent, you also, did you send a video of the, you having the pocket Yes. Okay. Was that, and that was. That was you, fantasy. You said no there. No, okay, that, that was. Straight fantasy. Okay, and that was kind of just thinking about this stuff here. Yeah. Uh, with Emily. Yeah. Okay, okay. It would be really hot to see a dog lick your Okay. And you said any dog, you said peanut butter will help with the dog thing. I heard it feels really good. Okay. So have you seen with peanut butter and dogs? Uh, yeah. Okay. Were there children involved in that too? Okay, that was just an adult? Adult, Okay. Yeah. So, so with the children and the dogs, that was? Telegram. Telegram, Straight okay. Telegram. How many of those, was it images or videos? It's videos. Okay. Give me a ballpark of how many of those are on your phone right now. Two, two videos of that on at your phone. Least. At least two. Yeah. From my what could it be at the most, do you think? Four. Four videos. So basically, a, is this the child like a infant, toddler, eight-year-old, nine-year-old? What do you think? Six through ten, I'd probably say. Six through ten. Yeah. And are they fully in that? Yeah. Okay. Is that in your gallery right now? Yeah. Okay. Okay. I don't just drink all my fantasy to you. Okay. Good, just got done working out. How long have you been going to the gym for? Probably a month now. Okay. Get some gains? I'm trying to. Okay. Yeah, there you go. Let's see. Gosh, okay. Pocket is a fake. Okay. I came so quick, as quick as when I first got started in CP, and you said I also watched CP earlier. Yeah, that was Telegram okay. and all that. Okay, so it hasn't been a few months, it's been real more recently. Did I say a few months for that? Oh, well, I meant weeks. A few weeks? Yeah. Okay. You think like two weeks? At least. Okay. And then you mentioned here that you want a child doll. It looks like a child, I don't know. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's a, I mean, you know, yeah. it's not CP. I mean, it's printed right here. I, yeah. mean, I didn't print it because it was like, you know, it's yeah. make sure it's legal here, but. Yeah. Okay, so how did you find out these even exist? I was just looking up small dolls. Small dolls? Yeah, just before even this. Okay. And that's how I even found it. Okay. Oh, Jesus Christ. All right, so basically, like, how much is that doll cost? With the way that I want that doll over a thousand. Really? Yeah. Okay. So I assume you were probably planning on getting it when you moved out? Eventually, yeah. Okay. So that's that's kind of my thing here. Um, how are you going to come up with that money? Just kind of save it up? Yeah, kind of save it up. Okay. So basically, you're kind of going job to job, from job to job right now, and you know, the painting, I'm sure it's not the worst, but you know, I'm sure it's not the best. Yeah. But so basically how much per paycheck do you think you're saving for this doll? As of right now, I'm not working. 
Okay. Well, you just sent a picture yesterday after work. Uh, that was around the house. Oh, painting around the house? Yeah. Okay. So, how much do you have saved up for it right now? Zero. You're, you're planning on doing it when you get a job? Yeah. Okay. How long do you think it would have taken to save up? With my painting, it took me a month to four and a thousand dollar PC. Okay, so you think it would probably take a month to save up? At least. Okay. And then, of course, you know, then comes the apartment and the everything, you yeah. know. So where was that even shipped, going to be shipped from? Honestly, I have no clue. Probably China. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> well, to be fair, that looks like an adult in China, though. <laughs> but... Do you guys care if I take a shot of whiskey on oh, the camera? Oh, go for it. Can you take one more shot of it? Just like, let's just chug it. Or, you know, if you want to, of course. So for, for the meds. Oh, dang it. Okay. <laughs> I do have another one in there, but I probably Yeah, no, yeah, later. don't, 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 don't. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. So basically, I mean, it got to the point where, you know, saying stuff like, I just find little girls really attractive. Yeah. Uh huh. So, I mean, it's, and there was also talk about- And then you about, could tell, like, once it started getting closer, I actually starting to think about it more and just like what the f am i doing right right i mean but it got to, i mean then it was also mentioned like you know this is kind of a fantasy for me to just have sex with a minor and stuff like yeah. that um so you know you know basically you know what do you do you live over that way that way that way okay i see so you know look the movie theater is right there yeah all right the Circle K, I mean, do your parents usually pick you up from the gym? I usually walk. Okay. They drop you off though, usually? Okay. So look, I mean, the Circle K is right there. The, the AMC is right there. Look, I mean, you mentioned earlier that you don't force yourself onto anybody, but yeah. you know, look, I, I checked them all beforehand. There was basically nobody in there. And the family bathroom obviously was empty. There was no family in there. I mean, talked about bleeding talked about having sex with her, putting my big in you, all of this type of stuff. So look, I mean, we saw where you were walking to. You said you were on your way, okay? Mm -hmm. There wasn't gonna be no, and look, look, like I said, dude, I'm not here to judge you, okay? Well, you've been so honest about probably 97% of everything, the one- Everything, 100%. Right, but there's no doubt that, you know, today you were headed to the AMC, she was, you were asking where she was. You could believe that, but in my head, I was. Right, just like, but, this, not but you know, risky. you mentioned you're on the way. Okay. To make it seem like I was on my way, but I was just right, going to go straight right. to my house. But, you know, there's a reason why we let you go buy the whiskey. Yeah. Okay. Look, the fact that you didn't drink all of it just now, I mean, you mentioned you were going to give her whiskey. Yeah. Okay. Look. I know you sent pictures earlier saying, I'm scared about the feds, I'm scared about yeah. this and that, I'm scared about everything. I, I, I know, I, I, yeah. I fully believe you were paranoid, for sure. But look, I know you wouldn't have forced yourself on her in the bathroom, okay? Mm -hmm. And if I know if she said, don't come, you wouldn't have came. Yeah. If she said, don't touch me, you wouldn't have touched her. If she got scared last minute, I don't think you would have done anything. No, I but look. We all saw where you were walking to. We saw you walk from the gym to the Circle K to there. Okay, we have the messages here. We, and look, it's not because you're a sick f it's because you have an addiction, but your addiction absolutely led you down this path. Yeah. It led you to the gym, to the Circle K, yeah. to there. Because look, Bailey, if you weren't gonna go, you just wouldn't have went to the gym. You would've stayed in the gym, you know? Yeah. So, look, man, I, I think you were gonna go there and kind of leave it up to her. Okay. Because from the messages, it kind of looks like some people could mistake it. You know, talk about bleeding, talk about all this, talk about like, you know, it could look like, but yeah. I don't think that was going to happen. I don't think you have the, I don't think you have, I'm not, and I'm glad you don't have the to do it. Yeah, I don't, I don't think you have the to do it, but I do know that you would have gone to the AMC and if she wanted to do the stuff in here, that's only when you would have done it. Yeah. Okay. So that's more accurate to say. Yeah. Okay. If I was 
even really if, deciding to go. Right. If if I'll, it, I'll look right in the camera and say. If it was kind of. I wasn't planning on really going, but if I decided to go, then yes. So it was more of just a possibility. Yeah. Okay. Because look, I mean. I don't know. I'm I'm more of the type to prepare for the worst, hope for the best. Right. So I've already had this kind of planned out, but hope for the best. Right. No, I know, but you know, like. But hey, this is probably what I need. Mm-hmm. Look, I know, but you know, I'm I can't be inside your mind. Yeah. But I can use common sense. I can see that you were at LA. I can see that you stayed there for five minutes. I can see you said, "Don't." I'm going to make sure my mom's in a circle K. Yeah. See when you said you were on the way, we saw you drink one of the whiskeys. You probably got yourself drunk because you're like, "What?" I'm just, I, I, you're like, you're probably like, I can't do this sober. Pretty much. Yeah. Okay. I was like, I'm gonna need a, at least a shot. Okay. So that tells me when I, as soon as I saw you, because I could tell there was nervousness. I mean, obviously you even sent a blanked out photo. But as soon as I saw you drink the whiskey, look, I know, I know pranksters on YouTube. Okay. Yeah. I'm, I'm friends with. I mean, you. I, I, I kind of want to do this shit. Catch. Yeah. That. Like exactly what you're doing, but for actually sure. like post it out for the world and all that. So maybe we could team up. And I, I would love that. But like, you know, I'm, I'm just saying I know people like pranksters and whatnot. Uh, do you know who Eric Konevsky is by chance? I've heard of him, but not really watched his stuff. You know Cassidy Campbell? No. Okay. Well, I know them and I know both of them before they go shoot videos. I grew up with Eric Konevsky in LA, okay? Mm -hmm. Before they go shoot videos, they all take a shot of whiskey because they're like, I'm about to do something really stupid, you know, yeah. in their case, maybe not illegal, but something, <laughs> something stupid. Yeah. And they're like, I can't do this. I, I can't do this shit sober. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I was kind of on the fence like, hey, is he going to go to the AMC? Is he not? But as soon as I saw you take the whiskey, drink the whiskey, I'm like, OK, he has a conscience about this, but he's doing it. He's doing it. That's why he drink the whiskey, because yeah. you're not going into this. You're not going into yeah. this fully sober. But and that's why I think, you know. There was a pretty big, there was a, there was a possibility that you were going to go into the AMC today, possibility today, you're going to go into the AMC, see her and let it be up to her and see what happens. Yeah. Okay. So after you drank, you were going to kind of put the ball in her court? Yeah. Okay. All right. To see if she wants to have her do any yeah. of that? Okay. All right. Well, I appreciate that, man. Um, speaking of that, the food courts should be open, right? Uh, Is it? I think so. Probably. The only that what place? restaurants are in there? Uh... I don't know, uh, dude. I've just moved here, honestly. <laughs> um, is that? I know that one place that had that fried pickles as the appetizers. Oh yeah. It just uh, I guess just, I guess just. I think it was an Outback. An Outback? Yeah, yeah at least. An Outback, yeah. Applebee's. Yeah, yeah. One there of those a places. Greek place. I love Greek food. Uh, I think I'm gonna call it Applebee's. Okay. What would you like from there? Fried pickles. Do you want anything? No, I'm good. All right. You still need this? Uh, yeah, if you want to call him yeah, on your You should have at least a camera so that we can record me blocking her. Yeah. Well, here, so let me, let me, uh, let me just tell you, man. So I'm going to tell you that for a living, I catch people going to meet kids for online. Okay. And all of this stuff. You don't need to block Emily. She was us the whole time. All right. So I, I kind of, I kind of, yeah. But, you know, I'm still going to block it so that there's not even any Leave no doubt, tape. sure. But let me, let me just tell you that obviously you're on the younger end of the spectrum that I confront, right? Yeah. You're not, you know, if you were 60 years old. Oh, I believe there's like people like 80 doing this shit. Oh, oh yeah, there is. Yeah. But, you know, let me, let me tell you, man, um, what's, 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 what's on that phone? What's on that phone right now? Uh, just a bunch of pictures and shit. Okay, let's not film that. Film me blocking her? Sure. That's what I'm doing. Alright, Bailey. So, I'm going to tell you, you said you were going to get a new phone soon? Yeah, I'm going to get okay. a new phone. For your sake, I'm probably... And a new phone number and all that. Just completely yeah. start new. For, for your sake, dude. For your sake. Do it. Right. Yes. Do that. All right. And for are soon. you Christian? Yes. You want to pray for me after this? Absolutely. For Alrighty. your for your sake. For your sake, what I would recommend is, because look, 
You can be without a phone for a day, yeah. or you can be with that shit your whole life. Yeah. I would probably recommend a phone without a day, definitely. I'd probably recommend. Let me see, let me see the phone, dude. Recommending that. Just don't even. I would say don't even touch anything. I'm just taking you to the camera right now. No, I don't want to see any of that. Just All right, okay. Okay. So yeah, did did I like touch any Rosenbaum, Joseph Rosenbaum? <laughs> yeah, I'm a uh, right wing. Yeah, okay. I was about to say that has to be a meme. It is a meme. I'm right wing. Well, dude, you have a fellow as <laughs> your screensaver. <laughs> Making fun of them. But... Right, right. Well, I mean, to to your credit, you know, you're, you're at least like uh conscious about it. Right, right. Yeah. Joseph Joseph Rosenbaum. He dated just to do that. Yeah. Yeah. No, Joseph Rosenbaum, he uh I mean, you know, he he died uh, going out getting penetrated by a teen boy. I mean, he, <laughs> you know, so Yeah. I'm right wing too. But okay, so did, did I like touch anything on your phone just now? No. Okay. What I'm going to do is I'm going to set it in airplane mode. All right. That's fine with me. Okay. So I, did I alter anything? Did I touch anything? No. Okay. I, I didn't like I delete anything. I didn't call anybody. Okay. I'm just going to put it in airplane mode here. There I'll do it for you right there and then right there that button. Okay. All right. Pipe up and then it's in airplane mode. All right, mind if I just chill you with can, it in here? Yeah, you can. Okay. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate it. I'm just gonna leave it. Uh, gonna leave it right here for now. Um, yeah, I mean, dude. So, what what do you think? Like, what, what are you gonna tell mom and dad? You gotta tell them something. I, well, you don't have to, but I would. I mean, cat's out of the bag. Yeah. I genuinely don't know. Are you planning on telling them something? More or less my counselor than them. Counselor? Yeah. That's confidential with her, right? With him, yeah. Her, him. Is it is counselor like state funded or private? State. State? Okay. I or at least my insurance. Insur insurance, okay, yeah. okay. What do your parents do for work? Just curious. My mom's retired and my dad uh, was painting for a sec oh okay for a while anybody's like slowing down a little bit oh pretty nice house is he like on his business or yeah oh nice you like work for him or did you work for him yeah oh okay makes sense makes sense this year's kind of been like hectic with the work really like a lot of it no not really like less of it yeah well you're painting yourself here in a pretty pretty bad light but you're also painting yourself in a good light yeah. Okay. Because I'm being honest. About because you're being it. honest. And I think. And I genuinely don't want to act on it. I mean, I was just so nauseous and all that. And I'm glad that I'm not. Glad that nothing happened. Yeah. yeah. I'm honestly kind of glad you guys. Yeah. Came. Yeah. So, what's the thing about like this whole shit fantasy stuff? When did that start? The shit in the. That's just fake fantasy. Did you get sent stuff like that too? That just kind of developed? Yeah. Okay. But it's not really like a fantasy that I think about often. I thought about it once and that was it. Okay. Well, I mean, it was talked about in the chat a few times yeah. here. So, I mean, is this like a newfound thing? It's okay if it is. I mean, I don't care. It could be. I uh, it genuinely don't know. Mm -hmm. Well, I mean... I guess getting yourself into some pretty deep shit today was a good thing for you, Dad. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah, yeah. But, um, okay, man, I mean, geez Louise, dude, I would just, uh... Work on it. Do you have any siblings at home? I do not. No, you're an only child. Only child. Only child. Have you ever been, like, accused of doing something like this before to anybody? Many times. Really? Yeah. What happened with that? Just died. They never really kind of pursued anything. Yeah. They was mostly just talking shit. Like to people in this area? Yeah, people were like talking shit. It was mostly my ex-friend. Ex-friend? Yeah. How old is she, she? He. He? He accused you of like doing stuff to him or to no, somebody, to his sister? Or? Just like making up stories that I was teaching 14 year olds how to f and all that, whatever I wasn't. When, I was only just viewing it and all that. Viewing like Yeah. Okay. How old were you at the time? I guess over 18. But uh, I think I was 18. 18? Okay. And he yeah. was 
It was he saying you're going around like the high school or the middle school kind of. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Even though that wasn't the case uh, during school, I was just mainly to myself. Not right. Really giving an absolute fuck about school and with him. So people have known about your thing for years then? No, it's not really. Or just him or? No, no one has known about it. It's just they, that's just the first thing that comes to their mind. Because they they assume. The yeah. Yeah. Okay. Is there any reason they could have known? I mean, they, they kind of guessed right. No reason. Okay. I mean, so he, so what exactly did he accuse you of, and with who? So, he accused me of racism with my ex black friend. All right. Well, I, I don't. Yeah. Okay. I don't that's, need to hear the that's victim a card. Different story. I'm worried about the other V card, not yeah. the victim card here. Okay. Yeah. I don't but care about that. With him, yeah, he was just accusing. That's it. And he did he accuse you of doing something with a specific girl, or no, just, just said in you? General. He just said you go around, did he say you go around having sex with 14 year olds? No, just teach them. You teach them how to have sex? Yeah. Okay. That's all he said in general. Did he say it was like the high school kids or the middle school kids? Or? Just 14 year olds. 14 year olds, how to have yeah. sex? Okay. I mean, is there, did he say you do it in person or? Just said that. I, just generally? Yeah. Kind of leaving it open for interpretation? Yeah. Why would he and say that? In, and it was in a group chat of all of the kids from my school yeah and all that including my friends at the time yeah yeah but they they denied all of it and all that well do you think maybe there was 14 year olds in the group chat that no, he thinks what, no what i think it is so before that all before the falling out with that friend he found a girlfriend who hated me yeah. and two other of my friends mm -hmm. She thought I was racist and all that. Hated Mexicans, even though I don't. Yeah. I mean, you live in Arizona. You can't be that hateful to them. I know, right? <laughs> and um, then it escalated to the... And then he threatened my life. And all that. Yeah. I mean, Bailey, is there... I mean, it just... I mean, you know, the whole race is, I mean, that's, that's horseshit, but like, they, is it, there, there has to be some merit because, you know, if you were 18 at the time, this, this is when you first started child. So I was still pretty good at hiding. Stuff. Right, right. But there has to be some type of merit. I mean, did you maybe just message them? Did they message you? No. They, they didn't, you know, these 14 year olds, they were maybe. Not at the time. No. No. Not at all. Okay, I mean, maybe a year or two later, were they just kind of curious and they hit you up? Like 19, yeah, that's kind of whenever it starts. Like with other 14-year-olds? Well, that's whenever they started, like, at least saying hi. Oh, that. okay. But I never really, like, and this was the got involved right. with them, like, send them and all that. Were these, like, the local girls here? Honestly, I don't even know. Did you I, know I, I, who I they were? I never really cared to ask where their location was because I just wasn't doing that at the time. Okay. Okay, but were there any girls like you knew from school that would hit you up like that? No? Okay. Did, did he just... Look at that. Did he just... Buy, he did, he, did he just get a drink? Uh, yeah, and they said they'll be here in like 20 minutes. Oh, the food? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> the audacity. Look at him. He just... He's making him, he's making him just hold like two freaking... Geek. Can you believe? Yeah. Your, your friends had to be better than him. <laughs> oh God, man! A little bit. Yeah, the audacity. Jeez. Okay. So, nineteen is when fourteen-year-olds online started hitting you up about, or they kind of started sending me, like, not. I wouldn't even say anything. Sure, they just sure. Would send it and all that. Now I would just look at it, but not even do anything or respond. I just click it, be like, oh, and then. Right. Right. And so, were those kind of more real than like the other ones? You think? I genuinely don't know. I just don't trust nobody. I mean, do they look like the profile photo? Some of them? It was a little bit? Snapchat. Oh, Snapchat. Yeah. Okay. So did they did they add you and just say, hey, I'm 14 F by the way, and then send you that shit? They never say their age, really, but I could tell by their body. That they were just kids? Yeah. Okay. Was it just kind of one of those, like, um, did they find you via search or did they just kind of quick add? Both. Okay. Okay. So they would just, would they open up with like a message first or just a snap? 
Sometimes it would just be hey, and then a nude, and sometimes it would just be a Okay. But I would look at it, and then be like, oh, and then right, right away, just get off. Okay. So what do you think, so the dark web stuff, you access that before or after Telegram? Before. Before. So you said you mentioned you use Google to search up c too? Very rarely. It's mostly normal adult. Right. Right. So how? So did you access the dark web on your phone or computer? Computer. Computer, okay. Is that the one you saved up for? Yeah. Okay. So that's the one in the house? Yeah. Okay. But I don't really access it anymore. Right. The dark web on it. Yeah. Is there, is there probably files on the computer you should get rid of too? No? There's not. I, I did that a while ago. Okay. So you wiped child from there? I asked them, can you just make this shit run like new? And they were like, yeah, give it the works. Oh, really? Yeah. So they, they didn't really know what was on there. They no, just kind of... just, they just okay. wiped it. Was there a shit ton to wipe? Like if I accidentally downloaded it, you know, because right. I'm not really trying to. Right, right. I mean, well, when's a you know, you know, and just so you know, um, you know, like I said, I can't do research on the dogs licking your... Yeah. But I can do research, research on your online search history, so, yeah. you know. And there's definitely on there. On the computer right now? No, not on the no. computer. No? On search history? Yeah. Okay. On your computer? Okay. Phone. What? What's it? So on your computer. There's no on my computer at all. Okay. What about search history? Search history, none. Okay. So it's all all the child. That's all on the phone. Yeah. And it was on your computer until they wiped it. More or less, whenever my mom was retired, which was. Uh, months ago. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Well. Uh, Okay, so what's going on? How's it going? This guy's here to have sex with who he thinks is an 11-year-old girl, and he also has child on his phone right there. I just had him set it there. Um, it's an airplane mode right now. Hey, we didn't with it. I'll talk to you over here. Sure, hey, sure, sure. Make sure you get the police on camera and everything. Okay, so what's going on? So you know that show, uh, To Catch a Predator? Oh, 
about to see, uh, see what we can do as far as getting stuff processed. Okay. okay. And, yeah, I mean, if you just keep, like, I mean, they're in order, but they're out of order, like, it's a good door right now, but you just keep, like, you know, put that in the back. Well, that is all pretty handy. Okay. Do you have any injuries yeah. now? Yeah. We guys just leave this stuff alone for now. Oh yeah, we're not. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna ask you. Expose them on YouTube. <laughs> yeah, no, for sure. Yeah, like, uh, uh, trying to work with you. I know, I know. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Jungle, for Thank you, Steph, for providing all your rocks and 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 rocks and